was ready for some regret and pain. Me, apparently. I'm going for a run. Here we go. This is my first attempt at like running. Well, of my own free will. Thanks, Mom. I thank you for your encouragement trying to get younger me to move, but I just would not listen. And now I'm regretting that. <laughs> I do have actually a goal that I'm aiming towards. The, uh, at least just the base of the mountain. I don't think I can make it all the way to the, uh, the top. I managed to run my first time running all the way up this mountain. I'm pretty freaking proud of myself. Also pooped. But I don't really have time to relax because uh, I gotta run back home. Because we need to go. Yeah, I know. Oh man, and I feel fantastic because uh, until this point in time today, it's kind of been a crappy day. Things, I was trying to edit yesterday's vlog and things were like, I was having issues and I was feeling really bummed and I didn't even think I would be able to go on this run. I would be disappointed in myself. And then I started running and I just kind of set this goal as like a lofty, like, yeah, but it's really far away and you'll never make it. I mean, granted, I've walked here before plenty of times, but never like, you know, jogging the entire time. This is significantly more physically demanding than this. I, I put this, I put this camera on this car. I just realized there's a guy right over there. <laughs> but yeah, pretty, uh, pretty freaking proud of myself. Oh my gosh, I have had good showers. I have had great showers, but that was a phenomenal shower. And uh, as you can see, we're about to go. So, uh, this camera is slowly falling. I'm not going to repeat that. I'm not a total Casey Neistat ripoff. Oh! <laughs> What's honestly mostly most surprising is that um, after that run, my legs don't hurt, but my arms do. Cause like, I'm so used to cycling everywhere that like, I've done much worse with my legs. But what doesn't get exercised when you're cycling are your arms. Literally, my arms are feeling very sore now from just the this action. How sad is that? I really need to, uh, exercise my arms a bit more. I feel like a freaking T-Rex. <laughs> got your spring flowers. Well these, well, these I want to put uh, where that other one is. I have all the Montana, but then there's that one in there that's not. I have no idea what she's talking about. We're back, Emmy. We're back. <laughs> so, Grandma, where's next? Dinner. Yay! Dinner. <laughs> <laughs> the exciting life of, I almost said the Howards, but technically you're not a Howard. <laughs> That's how family names work. Oh my gosh, look at that sunset. That's gorgeous, but I don't have time to really appreciate it because let's grab some lunch or dinner, yeah. not lunch. <laughs> Freaking Togo's, the yeah. world's best. There used to be one of these literally within walking distance back when I lived like in Sacramento. And so these just, I like it more for the sentimentality than the actual taste to be honest. Of course, that being said, like it is really good. <laughs> 
If you've never been to a Togowitz, by the way, it's really cool because it's like this sandwich shop, right? But then also a Baskin Robbins. Lunch and dessert, or dinner in our case, just food and dessert. My precious, I will be back for you. Oh man, I love LA sunsets. They're just so gorgeous. Oh man, so I've gone on and on about how good like exercise makes your brain feel or makes your body feel. But in my opinion, the best benefit to getting a lot of exercise, you just feel tired at the end of the night and fall asleep really easily. And uh, that's amazing to me. <laughs> so that's basically me just telling you I'm really sleepy. So this is the end of the vlog. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow for another fun-filled day of shooting with Corey. And in the meantime, remember, stay positive. And seriously, try and exercise today. This is me, I still on it. Cause you all want